from looking at what we have here, can you describe what it, what what we have, what you know, the good points, the, what well, the features? Well, again, so you've got you've got nice headers, which go into a nice wide pipe, a two and a one, comes back. Um, you've got and a head, solid that, state ignition system. That header and stuff is is been replaced. Yes, correct. That is aftermarket. Um, you've got a solid state ignition system, so you have no more points, no more condenser. Oh, really? There's nothing to adjust. Wow. Everything's electronic. Okay, I didn't I realize I converted that. everything over to electronic. Your um, battery cables, I forgot about those. Those are completely new. Okay. The charge wire that goes down from the battery to the alternator is also completely new. Okay. I made you all new ignition wires. Right. Um, and those are spiral core. They're not like the original stainless steel, which give off a ton of RF noise, which confuses the MSD box. From the standpoint of what's not stocked here, we got the Weber carbs. The Weber carbs are not stocked. These originally were two Solexes. Right. Now you've got a set of triples. So each, basically the way this is set up now is each cylinder has its own little baby carburetor. Right, yeah, and I, I noticed um, in looking for one of these cars, a lot of times you'll see two Weber carburetors Correct. on there instead of three. Yeah, what they'll do is they'll take the they'll take the stock Solexes off and they'll put two two-barrel Webers on it. Right. Um, this is a side draft, it's also known as an IDA. Um, this is a lot more efficient. It's more of a competition design carburetor. These really weren't designed for street use. Okay. But if you tinker with them, you can get them where they're fairly happy and as you noted, this car moves pretty good for its age. Yeah. And part of that is okay. the fact that it's got the levers on it. And then the next stage, I would suggest that, you know, go through all your brakes. You know, like new rotors, new pads, yeah. new lines. If any of the calipers look like they need to be rebuilt, rebuild them. Yeah. And you'll have a perfect little Toyota. Yeah. It's a great car. It drives incredibly well. It does. It really does. Uh, so yeah. you know, you'll have you'll have good long years of fun with it. Yeah. All right, man. Oh, it's been it's been fantastic. I mean, I, I probably wouldn't have bought the car if I hadn't have uh, found you guys to know that I had somebody that could work on it and help me with it.